Hello, this is Hello Gabius and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell notification and like this video. In today's video, I have like this massive haul for the cream shop and Hello Kitty collaboration. I purchased the cream shop at the cream shop online, but I also went to Marshalls and TJ Maxx and I found so many things that I was not prepared for. And I think I even went overboard in purchasing some of these cream shop items with Hello Kitty, but that's okay because nevertheless, it is Hello Kitty. So let's get started. I made myself a list here and I actually wrote down uh, everything that I purchased and where I purchased it, either the Cream Shop, Marshalls, TJ Maxx, and what price would it have been if I purchased it just at the Cream Shop because we all know that purchasing items at Marshalls or TJ Maxx, it's going to be a little cheaper. In fact, sometimes when they're trying to move items, products, some stores actually move them down to Marshalls and TJ Maxx. So whatever you find at TJ Maxx or Marshalls or all the all those other stores, it's going to be such a great find because um, maybe you didn't want to pay full price. Maybe you didn't find it at the time of release or um, you know, now they're just trying to just move inventory, like I said. So let me show you exactly what I purchased and then I will tell you where I purchased it and how much of a savings would it have been depending on where I purchased it. <laughs> I am so happy to do this haul. I couldn't wait. I have almost half of my desk filled with these items. So let's go ahead and get started. So I have my trusty list here. And the first item that I purchased was uh, a glass nail file set. Now this glass nail file set, I purchased it at Marshalls. I actually have two glass nail file sets and I saw this at Marshall's and I also saw this at the cream shop. Now, let me tell you, at Marshall's, I purchased $5.99 for this item and at the cream shop, it was for $12. So I actually purchased one for $12 and one for $5.99. I actually did not know that I had already ordered this from the cream shop. So let's go ahead and open it and see what it is exactly. So premium glass nail file set, Hello Kitty. And I do like it that it does have like a carrying case with it. So it comes with this really pretty carrying case. And so I do love it that they at least included an image here for Hello Kitty. That was very nice. Um, and so now, as far as the glass nail falls, so you can hear their glass. And, and the glass nail falls, they're red. Um, on the end and then it just has like two uh, images for Hello Kitty and actual Hello Kitty in the middle and it does feel rough just so you know it does feel rough now the thinner glass file does not have any images of Hello Kitty it just says the cream shop so it's only the bigger one that does have the actual image of Hello Kitty and so when you're putting it in your travel case it fits very nicely and i'm sure you could even put like perhaps a cuticle stick or anything else that you do to help prepare your nails so again this was at the cream shop for 12 dollars, and at marshall's was for 5.99 i'm not going to open up the extra one i am going to still keep it um and see maybe i can use it for a giveaway or something like that but we have an extra nail file set from the cream shop Next item is another crystal nail file. Now this is more like a Christmas theme and this is also a three piece set just like this one here. This was $4.99 at Marshalls and if I would have purchased this one again at the cream shop would have been $12. So I do love the packaging. I love the packaging for all of the cream shop. 
uh, products that they have. But this is very Christmassy. I love the gold foiling. You do see Hello Kitty here with like a Christmas Santa hat. That's also very nice. It's a great stocking stuffer. You do see the label here of what I purchased at Marshalls. So let me go ahead and open it and actually feel what they collect. So these are the three nail files and let me just say that again they also feel very rough on the end because it's a nail file so it absolutely should but I also like that they do have uh, at least one has an image of Hello Kitty and I always like to uh, if it is like a Hello Kitty product collaboration with you know whatever company it is to have Hello Kitty on the product somewhere uh, because it just adds that extra touch. So this one does have three Hello Kitties here on the end. The one in the middle does have like a pink end to it, like kind of ombre down to the end, does have a little pink Hello Kitty bowl. That's also very nice. And also the last one does have that Christmassy holiday theme with some little snowflakes, Hello Kitty, and then the cream shop on the end here as well. And of course they do feel rough on the end and they are glass. And so that makes it so nice. So I'm just gonna try, it doesn't belong to this set. I am going to try to put it into that travel case. But just to compare, they are the same size as the pink one. So let me see if they will fit here all together. I hope I don't break anything. And I mean, they almost do if I absolutely squeeze it. Um, maybe I just, if I leave one out, the other two will fit perfectly in here so you can have all of your nail files nice well and protected in this travel case so cool so this is my second uh, glass nail file set from the cream shop i also saw this uh, love quartz roller it's a dual end face and body and it is beautiful guys and again um i see hello kitty stuff and i just cannot help myself um I already have one of these items, but I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't necessarily gravitate towards using it, but this one is Hello Kitty and the Cream Shop, so I just might. I might have it here in my Hello Kitty room then. I do have the one I have in the bathroom, and maybe if I have this one here, I might gravitate towards using it all. So this is just a tool that I didn't necessarily have a daily use for maybe it's because i just wasn't into practice to using it but let me go ahead and open it and show you exactly what the roller looks like as far as the packaging it's a very lovely packaging again the cream shop and hello kitty are just always you know spot on with packaging you can easily easily wrap these up especially christmas coming right around the corner and you do see the marshall label here so i did spend at marshall's 12.99 if i would have purchased this one at the cream shop online would have been 22 dollars so it's just a basic, if you ever have a face roller, that's exactly what this is. Um, and of course it feels just so calming on the face. Really, really nice. And I don't know why I don't gravitate towards using something like this, I should. Just feels so calm, so soothing. So anyways, um, as far as the roller itself, I love that it does have Hello Kitty uh, image on it with the cream shop and again this is something that I see myself just placing here on my desk and whenever I see emails or review something I can always use it on my face and help me relax a little bit so we also have a face roller now we have a depuffing and comforting gel eye mask so this eye mask I did purchase it at Marshalls and I saw another one as well on the cream shop online and it was a 
believe a little bit more of the holiday holiday theme the one I saw online so on Marshall's I did spend $4.99 now if I would have purchased this at the cream shop I would have spent $12 so this is almost twice the price uh, at the cream shop online than what I purchased it at Marshall so that at least makes me feel a little better so let me go ahead and open it and see what they look like these are always good for if you already have like the normal um, under eye patches this is also good for all over the eye if you put it like in the fridge it'll really really help with cooling off your eyes and also I even have these but they are like um, like little ice packs and uh, you can use these for little ice packs as well I love it that they just are shimmery they are so shimmery so so pretty look at that they smell plasticky but I'm sure that smell it's gonna go away but I absolutely love the Hello Kitty image on that love it love it love it and then you can just put it over your eyes and just take a little break and uh, you know it'll also help you relax as well so I got two depuffing eye masks next we have a sweet strings plush head spa so I saw these head spas and let me tell you um, I couldn't help myself I love this one because the packaging is so pretty so this one actually has the little like a gift tag on it and absolutely this is not a throwaway I'm definitely keeping this gift tag and you can easily put it to and from and a very good stocking stuffer item I want to say and I really like this one because it's just a soft pink and white so it's stripes uh, pink stripes and it's this plush a spa headband and then you do see the Hello Kitty here and the cream shop logo on here the packaging is very holiday very Christmassy uh, everything else pink gold foiling very very nice and you do see this one I did purchase it at TJ Maxx so this one I purchased it for $6.99 now at the cream shop online it would have been $14 so again almost double the price uh, that I paid for at TJ Maxx and it's just exactly the same as all other uh, cream shop headbands um, they're nice and plushy so soft and very simple to use one thing I do want to say is that I've noticed that I have a very small head and the majority of the cream shop uh, plushy headbands fit so tight I'm not sure if you also have that same concern or that same issue I cannot have it on for long it's like I put it on and I need to wash my face like quick because I feel that it's just compressing my head so bad I don't know if you have an issue like this if you also have like the same concern will you let me know am I like the only one that is experiencing this kind of concern but I feel like they're just so amazingly tight for some reason it's good it's keeping your hair all together um, but it's like ugh, I feel like I can't keep it on my head that very long but nevertheless here is a pink uh, stripe headband Now I did purchase a second headband and this one to me just screams out Christmas. So this one is the Red Gingham Plush Spa Headband. I purchased it at Michael's. It is a limited edition and this was for $6.99. Now as far as the price at the cream shop, there were no headbands on the cream shop online website that matched this exact color. But note that the headbands at the cream shop run between $9 and $14. So the price would have been around that range. So nevertheless, I got it cheaper, I'm sure, at Marshall's. So the packaging, again, it is so nice. I love it. This one is just so Christmassy. Like maybe if you're wearing your 
plaid um, sleepwear, uh, you know, your pajamas to kind of go with your headband. It's going to look very nice, very cohesive. But just like the pink one, this one is also very plushy, very hard to get out. But just like the pink one, like I said, look at how pretty this is. Two little pillows here for the bow. It just makes it so beautiful. I love it. Okay, so now we're moving on to the sheet mask. And this is going to be a long video, guys. So please hang on with me. And also at the end of the video, I want to show you where I'm putting some of these items in my Hello Kitty room. This is the Appley Ever After sheet mask. This one is the Halloween theme. Now this one, I purchased it at TJ Maxx. And at TJ Maxx, I paid $4.99 for it. On the cream shop, they also had a set of three pack, not necessarily this one specifically, but they ran for $10. So now this one is a set of three and I only got it for half the price than if I would have paid at the cream shop online. So I think it's an awesome, awesome savings. You get three of them. And of course, we all know that the cream shop and Hello Kitty, the way they have the face mask, I mean, I almost do not want to throw them away. So let me open them up and see what they look like. Now I'm only going to open the box itself. I'm not going to open the individual sheet masks inside until I'm ready to use it. So this is what they look like. Um, these again are also great stocking stuffers very very pretty and i absolutely love it now i've noticed that even though i found them at marshall's or at tj maxx um there are still a 2022 product which is absolutely awesome and i was very happy with that because i almost thought they're trying to push products away and they're sending them to those stores where you can buy them uh, more easier and the cream shop to you know make room for newer inventory it is still this year's product which is good so it's not like two or three years ago so cool i absolutely love it so this is my first set of sheet masks my second set of sheet mask is the Hello Plump and Kin printed as in sheet mask. So we went from Halloween and now this is Thanksgiving. Beautiful packaging as always. Uh, again, Cream Shop never fails. Again, this is a set of three. This one I purchased it at TJ Maxx and I got it for $4.99. I did not find this specific one at the Cream Shop but a set of three sets of sheet mask at the cream shop again were ten dollars so i got it for half the price so to just open it up really quick beautiful so pretty so perfect because it's not thanksgiving yet so this is very very just in time we have another set of sheet masks and these are the Merry and Bright Printed Essence Sheet Mask. How beautiful is this? So I got this one at Marshalls and this was, this is a Christmas theme, so pretty. So we're going from Halloween, Thanksgiving and now we're at Christmas and the, the packaging is adorable. And I love it that here it makes it look almost like a postcard because you could also put like a to and from, uh, very giftable. Uh, no need to wrap this up actually. So this was $5.99 and I got it at Marshall's and again at, tea, at the cream shop. I didn't find this specific one, but they do have a set for $10. So I paid half the price. Beautiful, beautiful packaging. So let's open it up and see what the individual sheet masks look like. So pretty guys, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful packaging guys. And look at this on the back. It does, they make it look like a postcard. So pretty. So, so, so pretty. Cool. I have plenty of sheet masks now, right? So that is my third set of sheet masks. Now my fourth and last one, this is 
again so adorable it says pretty potion collagen hyaluronic sheet mask and this one it's also a christmas theme now here this one i did purchase it at the cream shop and at the cream shop i purchased just this single sheet mask because there's only one in here for four dollars i did not find any of one of these looking like exactly the same one at marshall's or at tj maxx only at the cream shop now what is surprising to me is that this one uh, being that I didn't find it at TJ Maxx or at Marshall's and that it was still on the Cream Shop website. This is a 2021 product. Isn't that weird? That I still found it online and it's already a year old versus the ones that I didn't find at the website. They are, they're still current. So I thought that was very, very weird. Nevertheless, again, just like the other sheet mask, they looks like a postcard from the back, uh, very giftable, great stocking stuffer, perfect for Christmas. Um, I absolutely love the image. This is just so beautiful. So that is the last of my sheet masks. Now let's move on to other things. So let's move on to the body scrubs, uh, body fusions. I got this big chonker. Look at the packaging. Look at how beautiful this is. So this is a two-in-one fusion body scrub and this is um, limited edition pink lid rose gold. Um, this one gives like a more of a fall or autumn theme and I guess I'm, I'm guessing that because of the leaves on here. But um, this one, I got it at the cream shop for $12. Now, uh, because I purchased items, like I said, from the actual Cream Shop website, I found this one at the Cream Shop for $12. I did not find this one at Marshalls or at TJ Maxx. Um, but I, I just can't wait. So again, the scent for this one is Autumn Vanilla Rose. Ooh. So I got my trusty Kleenex box here because I know I'm going to be making a mess. Uh, so let's go ahead and open it. Ooh, look at that. I can smell the vanilla. I don't really smell the rose. Mm. But it's like putting... It's like lotion. It's it's very uh, creamy. It's not greasy. Ooh. Mm. I smell more the vanilla. I don't really smell uh, the rose, but I know it's going to be heaven using this in the shower. So I need to close this up before I make a bigger mess. But this is such a chunky... Uh, jar I absolutely love it and um, I can't wait to use it in the shower so this is my first body scrub now uh, this is a bath bomb I saw these and uh, I thought wow these are so pretty bath bombs from the cream shop I mean they are just humongous this is the size of my hand almost they're very hefty I love that they emphasize the Hello Kitty bow and you can clearly see the Hello Kitty image on here and the whiskers and everything and you see the cream shop lettering here in the back as well so very nice so again this one I purchased it at Marshall's for $4.99 and if I would have purchased this one at the creep shop would have been $7 saved about a couple bucks buying it at Marshall's which is not bad at all very beautiful now the next bath fizz I have is a another 3d bath fizz and it's a strawberry cocoa aroma um know that the peppermint one I didn't get any swift 
or smell of peppermint. I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. Um, but again, these are 2022 products. Um, so they're not like old, old products. I didn't get any scent to it. Um, now this one, again, this is a strawberry and cocoa aroma. I purchased it at Marshall's and I purchased it for $4.99. And if I would have purchased this one at the Creep Shop, it would have been $7. So I saved a couple bucks there. Um, so let's open it and see if maybe I can actually get a smell for this bath fizz. A little bit more pink and the bow is a little darker pink uh, same size these are pretty hefty if you want to know the size of actually these bath bombs these are 5.64 ounces pretty hefty okay I get a slight scent to this one um yeah so I'm wondering how long it's gonna take to actually dissolve in water um, nevertheless, like just like the other one, I mean, these are in such great condition because such great packaging from the cream shop. Very, very beautiful. Um, and I just can't wait to use these. Very nice. Smells very nice. So guys, I got me a set of bath bombs and this is the Lux Spa Fizz. Um, this one's Sweet Rose and Lovely Vanilla. Same sizes, 5.64 ounce is each. Now let me tell you a little bit. So this is a limited edition. This is enriched with vitamin E and I purchased it at Marshall's for $8.99. And if I would have purchased this one at the cream shop, would have been $12. Packaging is amazing. So this specific bath bomb said I did not find it at the cream shop, but I found something similar. Now uh, at the cream shop, it was a different Hello Kitty set and it was for $12. So nevertheless, I still would have gotten it for about $3 cheaper at Marshall's. So let's open this up and see what they smell like. So this is supposed to be the Sweet Rose. They're all big and hefty. I don't get the rose scent. Um, and again, I don't know if that's good or bad because um, sometimes perfumey products, uh, even a month after, two months after, just get a stench kind of a smell like a bad or an old perfume smell this one I guess as time goes on maybe the smell is just goes away so I don't know if that's a good or bad thing do I prefer it not to smell or have that ugly stinking old perfumey smell of what it you know probably used to smell like if it was a fresher product so um Nevertheless, um, it's it's a beautiful bath bomb. Now this one is supposed to be lovely vanilla. This one has like a gold bow on it. So, so pretty. You know, I, I don't know. This one has a little bit, yeah, vanilla smell to it, but I don't know if I'm saying it because it the smell is supposed to be lovely vanilla but as far as um these two if i'll be closing my eyes i don't know that i would smell the difference so like i said i don't know if that's a good or bad thing uh but they don't stink which is a very good thing and ah uh, they're just beautiful beautiful bath bombs. so i got two more okay so now we are moving to the bath bombs or the bath fizz and a matching scrub to it. This one is the Peach Petal Silky Skin Spa Set. 
and it's assuming that it's a bath bomb in the same scent because it doesn't say but I'm assuming because the scent is out of the package that is what it reads both items are the same scent so this one is to exfoliate and renew I got it at TJ Maxx for $9.99 I did not find this one at the cream shop but a scrub and bath fish shown on the cream shop was about $19 so I really saved $10 for buying this one at TJ Maxx so that's good you're gonna always get a bigger savings as I see so peachy let's open this up so many gift sets so this one and let me just say that all of the bath bombs so far are in different colors and in different scents I have not had a repeat scent with all of my purchases. So, peach. I get a slight, slight smell of it, but very, very nice, very beautiful, intact. Now, as far as the scrub, I'm very curious on the scrub. Look at the packaging. So beautiful, a big, big jar, big, big jar. So let's open it up and see. Ooh, very, very thick. I smell a little bit of peach. I mean, I feel like I have to almost eat it. A little, little peach, but you can see it's a very thick consistency and um, very silky feeling as well. I can't wait to use this. Absolutely. We have a rosy strawberry silky spa set, two in one uh, fusion body scrub, moisturizing bath bomb and body scrub. Got this one at TJ Maxx for $9.99, so same thing. Uh, did not find this specific one at uh, the cream shop online but I saved a good ten dollars just with this because a set like this at the cream shop would have been about nineteen dollars and I got this one only for $9.99 awesome price so again this is now a different scent this is a rosy strawberry scent so let's open it up and take a closer look Pretty. So this one is like a purplish bow, light pink bath bomb. Really pretty. Ooh. So now let's look at the scrub. Beautiful, guys. So pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. So let's open it up. So thick. Let's see what it smells like. Okay, I get the strawberry with this one. Definitely, right away. I smell the strawberry. Might not get the rosy strawberry, but the strawberry for sure. Man, this almost looks like a dessert because of the way it smells. It smells really good. And I'm sure it's going to be the same consistency. I'm not going to touch it, um, but it's going to be marvelous. <laughs> So excited I'm relaxed already knowing the awesome spa day I will have and again stay tuned at the end of the video for me to show you where I'm going to store my bath bombs so now as far as my list I have three pages I'm on my last page so please bear with me and thank you so much if you stayed on so far uh, on this video so now we have a cherry blossom scented lovely luxury set. Uh, and when I saw this, guys, oh my gosh. This is what I have. Ta-da! 
it comes in such a beautiful, beautiful box. Look at how pretty this is. Beautiful box. Beautiful. So this is a cherry blossom scented. Um, and it does have a bath bomb, a sugar body scrub, bath crystals. I got it at Marshall's for $16.99. Did not find this one at the cream shop, but if I, I did find a Disney one, exact same thing at the cream shop online, but Disney. And the one on Disney was $25. So I'm assuming uh, if they would have had a Hello Kitty, it would have been about the same price for $25. So that means that I saved $8 just buying it at Marshall's. Awesome. Look how beautiful. This is such a beautiful, beautiful box. And this is definitely a keepsake box. I am not throwing this box away. Uh, and let me remove this tag here oh let me just show you inside oh I can't let's see so I moved this nice uh, uh, gold pink ribbon on it let me show you the box how pretty this box is so so pretty and I love that it has a magnetic closure so let's open it up now let me show you inside Look at how beautiful it is. Look at the lining of this box. How pretty is that? So that is what it looks like. So pretty. Now this one, the only difference with this gift set that I haven't shown you already. Um, is one actually the scent because it's cherry blossom but this one comes with bath salts in a smaller bath bomb let me show you the bath bomb it's just like a, a rose gold uh, ball here it's very sparkly and i'm not sure if the camera is picking that up but it is so pretty guys so so pretty absolutely love it and it comes with bath fizz pretty hefty collectible jar i'm not gonna throw this away so pretty love the packaging and i love the ombre look to it too very nice and then we do have our body scrub and oh, this is just amazing amazing these packaging so i want to open this body scrub so that i can smell it get a bigger Ooh. Mm. i get a slight blossom smell Maybe it smells sherbet. That's what it smells like, a sherbet. Um, like if you're smelling like sherbet ice cream, that's what it smells like. Not necessarily a uh, cherry, uh, but nevertheless, um, it doesn't smell bad, which is good. So, oh, it is so nice. I just cannot wait. Cannot wait to use all of these products and this keepsake box is just awesome cool. okay so now we are down to the last two so the reason why I wanted to order from the cream shop is because I saw these two jars I had seen them on TikTok or somebody on Instagram probably posted it that they saw them at Marshall's and I was like, I need to get my hands on these guys. So these are glass jars. And they are filled with cotton swabs and uh, like Q-tips. So this one in particular, I mean, look at how beautiful this is. So I've had my eye on the Pottery Barn. They have two 
uh, jars that you can put on your desk and I'll show you a picture of that but they are like for $69 and I was like I don't want to pay $69 for these set of jars they are very beautiful and PB teen is going to be all I mean awesome quality for sure but then when I saw a picture of these somebody posting I said oh my god let me see if I can get these it's more like a dupe per se from a pottery barn product but this one is an 80 premium exfoliating cotton pad pads cheek large reusable glass jar it's a 14.63 ounce and I absolutely love the lid because it's Hello Kitty I mean how could you not love this you can put it around your desk it says Hello Kitty, Hello Kitty outside, and because it's glass, I couldn't believe it. So this was, this bigger jar was $14. I did not find this at Marshalls. I did not find this at TJ Maxx. If I would have found it, even though I've ordered it already at the cream shop online, I still would have purchased a second one for sure. You can, I can decorate my whole Hello Kitty office with all of these jars. So let's go ahead and open this up. I'm afraid to scratch the lid. Ooh, so these are the cotton swabs. So they're just typical cotton swab. Um, it looks like they might not leave too much lint, which is uh, very good. I can definitely use this for my face or keep it in my Hello Kitty room because I also do my nails. I use a lot of um, I use a lot of monomer for acryl acrylic, but also for acetone to remove nail polishes and things like that. Um, and this is perfect. Look at it, this is so awesome. And the lid itself, the lid itself is awesome. So it's not a screw on, um, as you can see here in the jar, it's not a screw on, it's, you just put it on and off, that's all it is. Okay. As far as the smaller jar, so this one is um, 180 premium cotton swab, chic reusable glass jar. This one is 11.29 ounces and this one was for $12 at the cream shop. Again, I did not find the smaller jar at TJ Maxx or at Marshalls. Um, but I absolutely love it because I have the set. I can't believe it. Now I don't have to buy those glass jars at Pottery Barn. So let's open this up. And so this one has the, like those Q-tips, um, the one that you can really get maybe in the corner of your eye or you're tr trying to do some makeup work on your eye and then a regular cotton swab. A regular q-tip here this one definitely can be in the bathroom looking so pretty and the lid so pretty so I cannot wait to use these glass jars I am so 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 happy so this completes my massive purchase for the cream shop and Hello Kitty collaboration I am just I think I've been living under a rock because I'm, to be perfectly honest, I have, I don't think I have ever stepped foot in a Marshalls or a TJ Maxx. I've gone to Home Goods. I've never ventured to the TJ Maxx side. Why? I have no idea. It just never caught my attention. I always thought they were products that were discontinued, but mostly my mindset was that they were products that were expired. And I'm like, why would I want to buy products that were expired? Anyways, but because I saw those pictures of them posting Hello Kitty items on the cream shop from Marshalls, I'm like, where have I been? Why haven't I have why haven't I ever ventured <laughs> to that side? I am so glad I did, and I was so happy, so excited that here in El Paso I was able to find this massive, massive haul here in El Paso. Hello Kitty and the cream shop. I am over the moon. I am just so ecstatic for finding all of these awesome, awesome items. Now, to give you just a quick recap. So, um, as far as all of the items that you saw here in this video, 
I purchased it for a total of $140.83. That is a lot of money, but it was a lot, a lot of stuff. Now, if I would have purchased all of these items just at the cream shop, it would have been $200.36. It would have been $236. So I really did save about $45, which is not bad because although some stuff I couldn't buy it at Marshall's and some stuff I couldn't buy it at the cream shop. I'm glad for the stuff that I couldn't buy at the cream shop online because I was able to find it at Marshall's or at TJ Maxx. So nevertheless, with some price comparisons and um you know, uh, tallying everything up, obviously it's gonna be so much cheaper to buy at Marshalls or at TJ Maxx. I will now forever stop at Marshalls and at TJ Maxx now. So I'm here in El Paso and I go to the one on the west side. So the one, for the ones that are familiar in to El Paso, the one on the west side, the Marshalls, is the one that is closest on Sunland Park, which is where Target's at. That is the Marshalls that is closest to me. The TJ Maxx that is closest to me is at West Town, which is like where um, there's like a new cinema, there's a Walmart, and there's like so it, it's like a whole shopping center. And it's obviously right next to Home Goods. I think all the TJ Maxx is next to or like in the same uh, in and out with uh, Home Goods. That's the one that is closest to me at town or at West Town. But I am just so happy. I want to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me show you where I'm going to be storing my bath bombs now. So I have such a mess, guys. Look at all of these boxes. Um, but let me show you where I'm going to put my bath bombs. So I had previously purchased, this is a new uh, jar, glass candy jar, that I have three and um, I wanted to buy this bigger one to move all of the little plushies into this big one so they were able to fit in the two which freed this one up and this is where I'm gonna put my bath bombs. So here you go. I will have my bath bombs here. So here it is. My scrubs, my salt, my bath bombs. I'll have it here temporarily until I move this into my bathroom. But oh, I just love it. I want to thank you so much for sticking with me. I had such an amazing time, obviously, buying these products. I mean, Merry Christmas to me, right? And I want to thank you so much for watching this video. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to hit that bell notification to notify you of when I upload a new Hello Kitty video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.